Bonjour Genie Engineers! In this video, I'm going to go over the books you need for geotechnical engineering. See, a lot of people have asked me in the past, what kind of books should I get for the FE Civil exam? Now, if you haven't subscribed yet, please do so and don't forget to hit the bell so you get notified when I release new videos. Now, let's get started. Okay guys, so the first thing you need to learn about geotechnical engineering is that it covers two topics. So we have soil mechanics and foundation. Now, if you're planning to take the FE Civil, you probably already bought or planning to get the FE Civil Review Manual by Linderberg, which is an awesome book. It does go over a uh, concept and it does give you a lot of problems to practice. Some of the problems there are a little bit harder than the FE exam and some are just easier, but that is okay because all you need is just to practice all type of different problems. Now, I would also recommend that you get the FE Civil Practice Problems book uh, by the same author, Linderberg, and it just, uh, it doesn't really go over concepts. It just directly gives you just problems to practice, which is good. I also want to emphasize on something, guys. The best way to learn something is by doing it and by doing it a lot. So I recommend that you do a lot of practice problems. I try to post, that's what I try to do here. I try to post many videos as I can so that you can get exposed to a lot of problems and that way you see the different type of problem that you might get in the test. And at the same time, you also get faster at it and which is good because you need to kind of save time during your FE exam or the midterm or final. But for the FE review manual, if you didn't take these classes in college, that might not be enough because the book, it just kind of like a review. They just expect you that you already took these classes before. You're already familiar with the material and we're just going to review. So I would recommend in that case that you get these two books. So one for soil mechanics and one for foundation. So for soil mechanics class, I would recommend that you get the fundamentals of geotechnical engineering by DAS. And for foundation, you get principles of foundation engineering by the same author. Don't worry about it, I will leave the link in the description below in case you guys want to check it out. Okay, so for the geotechnical engineering book, I would recommend that you go over geology, index properties and soil classifications, phase relations, laboratory and field tests, uh, and then for the foundation, maybe go over the effective stress, we have the stability of retaining walls, shear strength, uh, settlement, soil stabilization, all the material, that, uh, that is related to foundation. Now, for those of you who already took this class, I would recommend that you go over your notes because you're already familiar with it. You're already familiar with the material. It, your brain is going to remember real quickly and you're just going to be like a review. And then you can go ahead and take do the problems on the FE manual. And on the next video, we're going to cover all the material that you need to know for geotechnical engineering for the FE exam. So don't forget to hit the bell so you get notified when I release the video. Okay guys, so if you have any questions, please leave it in the comments below and I will make sure to address it in the future. Now keep in mind that a lot of these problems or questions that I answer here, it is because people have asked me these questions before. And don't forget to like, subscribe, and make sure you share with your friends who might find it helpful. Thank you guys for watching, and I will see you soon. À la prochaine!